Hey, what's up, guys? Meteorologist Doug Hetty. It is uh, Saturday afternoon. Of course, I'm getting ready for the big uh, Go Gold Gala, which is going on this evening. But of course, my luck, we have severe weather, which is going to be rolling in as we go through the evening hours. Of course, a Weather 2020 video. Huge shout, shout out to my boy Superior Roofing and Construction. They're a four state premier roofing contractor they're locally owned joplin missouri 7th and high street they did my roof uh, last summer so if you have roofing needs make sure that you give them a call all right let's see what's going on outside uh my voice is a little bit on the horse side but look at the thunderstorms on the east side of kansas city spreading north central parts of missouri so we do have a severe thunderstorm watch which is in effect north central missouri and then it does include the Kansas City metropolitan area and we do have some pretty good storms so we're really looking from uh, Chillicothe over toward Macon, Kurtzville, uh, another big storm just north of Sedalia. We have another guy just south of Belton which is starting to develop but what we're really going to keep our eyes on, oh well, let's check these guys out too, a couple little thunderstorms uh, south of Tulsa as well but what we're going to keep our eye on is a front which is draped out across southeastern Kansas. And as that pushes in, that is really going to fire off those showers and thunderstorms for us a little bit later on tonight. So let's go through time. Uh, we're going to move to 6 p.m. All right, I'm going to zoom in. Thunderstorms continue. Kansas City, Sedalia, um, over toward Warrensburg, Butler. And then let's go into southeastern Kansas, Independence, Sedan, Bartlesville, Tulsa. So this is 6 p.m. Now, as some of these guys out here, Independence, Sedan, Nowata, a few of those could rotate. I don't think we have a very big tornado threat, but when they blow up, they could be surface-based supercells. And if they are, we could get a few that try to rotate. So we're going to have to keep our eyes on that. As we go through the next few hours let's go through time thank you sir as we get to 7 30 p.m you can see the storms explode in the northeastern oklahoma southeastern parts of kansas now at this point in time i think our tornado threat goes down and we kind of switch more to a very gusty wind uh hail threat so northeastern oklahoma once i get into miami Venita, grand lake i think we are looking at more of a high wind threat let's go a little bit farther north chanute Yates Center, Mound City, and then over toward Warrensburg, Sedalia, all still seeing strong to possibly severe storms. All right, let's continue through. We're going to stop at 9 p.m. We have strong to severe storms. So this is going to be Nevada, Lamar, Lockwood, Mount Vernon, all the way down through Joplin. So the, the heaviest may be through Joplin at this point in time at 9 or 10 p.m. Neosho, Pineville, all the way back toward Grand Lake. Uh, still very strong to severe storms. Again, I think our tornado threat is low. Tornado threat's a little bit higher when these guys blow up at 5 or 6, 7 p.m. But after that, it's mainly a hail and wind threat. All right, let's continue. Here's 11 p.m. Still very strong to severe storms from Grand Lake all the way down to Fort Smith, Muskogee, uh, over toward Fayetteville, Bentonville, Beaver Lake, Branson, Springfield, all seeing strong to severe storms will continue here's midnight a few storms on the back side try to pop up southeastern parts of kansas but most of the storms now kind of along i-40 from little rock over toward oklahoma city as we continue through the night here's 3 a.m heaviest storms now west central parts of arkansas and most likely by this point in time any severe threat is pretty much gone so as we go into the daytime hours tomorrow we look pretty good there could be an isolated storm but most of sunday is looking pretty good all right guys i wanted to give you guys an update on what we are uh, kind of looking for as we go through the evening and the overnight hours for us tonight of course i'm going to be at the go gold gala sam lane is going to be doing the five six nine and ten so uh, make sure you tune in to him, and of course, I'll be checking in as well. Hopefully, the storms don't get uh, too big as we go through the overnight hours tonight. All right, guys, any questions, comments, leave them in the comment section below. 
Pulture Hatsune.